Hey, ninjas and ninjas, how you guys doing today? Um, was playing Warframe last night, actually teaching Ropadog a little bit about the game, and uh, while Lex is awesome, I did want to uh, go ahead and play some more today, so figured I'd do so on stream. Um, don't really have anything necessarily planned, so I figure I'll just do some uh, defenses or that type of thing and uh, just grind out. Like, I don't actually need any of these parts, but I've got too many to, to not, you know, let's get rid of some. <laughs> Potato, potato, potato. <laughs> uh, got a crazy little song in my head this morning. Let's see here. We got Z Ruck 21, Cerber Us Dilla, and I did not leave the last one. Sorry we didn't get back on with Hawken uh, last night like I had said. Like that was the plan. <laughs> Only uh, it just didn't end up happening. Um, Guap ended up joining us on Warframe and uh, it was pretty late by the time he got home anyway. So just didn't end up, end up doing the stream. Found a fissure. Look out for reactant. God, I love this shotgun. Use that reactor. Open a relic. Keep fighting. For more. Yay, reactant. One thing I do wish they put on there is that you could decide how much um, for something you've done before that Lotus or Ortis talk to you. Because it's like, I've been playing this game for a long time. I don't need, uh, <laughs> I don't need Lotus to tell me, hey, you need to go pick up React it every couple of minutes. Hell yeah, that's what we like to see. All enemies die at the same time. I am extremely happy that they uh, changed how the reactant works though and now it can be sucked up by vacuum from your companion, which is just fucking fantastic. about making that easier. Seven out of ten in round two. Doesn't normally happen. Do 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 do. Normally I let everybody know that I'm streaming in a thing, but I'm not going to do that right now. I'm just grinding out, we're not actually trying to accomplish anything. So. And that was me picking up the last one I needed. Woohoo! 
Wonder how long they'll want to uh, want to stay in here. I mean, it doesn't really matter. We can just keep coming back, but. Seems like a decent team that I got put into, so that's always helpful. Someone's being stalled. And it's not me. Incidentally, I have killed several bosses here recently and not gotten any emails from the stalker. What, what's going on with that? Wow. Okay. I haven't had one of those death squads been sent after me for a while either. Don't get me wrong, they happen. <laughs> The last time the Stalker was sent after me uh, was when I was using a Warframe that was low level and uh, did not have good equipment on them, so Stalker actually killed me. Which sucks because normally whenever I'm playing a good character that I've got, when the Stalker shows up, it's not like I one-shot him, but I, I do get rid of him fairly quickly. Which is awesome to me because trying to get rid of him before was such a pain in the butt. So anything that can make that easier is good in my book. Chat here, nobody, so that's fine too. <laughs> it is still very early, guys, so don't get me wrong, I fully understand. Plus, it's Sunday, which means that right now, most of you, if you are young enough to still be living at home, or uh, if you yourself practice, you guys are probably Unless off at church right now. Which I would be if I could find one around my area that I actually cared for. Most of them that I go into are just not something that I'm really, really looking for at the moment. Um, like the the ones that are closest to me, uh, <laughs> just not not good in my opinion. Not to mention that I uh, also, on top of everything else. Uh, I don't want one that even has format on it. There we go. Um, <clears throat> what was I talking about? Church. Keep fighting. <laughs> I was up really late uh, last night, guys. I uh, played a little later than I normally would uh, uh, with Lex and Guap, and uh, my brother actually joined in. And uh, on top of that... I, uh, after that, I started, uh, chatting around with one of, uh, Lex's friends, and, uh, she is, she's pretty awesome, I have to, I have to say. So, kept each other laughing until about, like, 2 or 3 o'clock in the morning, something like that. And I normally get up at 3 o'clock in the morning, 3.30. <laughs> so, needless to say... I would have uh, slept in longer this morning, only my cat doesn't allow that to happen. As much as I love Siri, somewhere in the realm of uh, about 8.30 on the weekends, regardless of what I'm doing, she's ready to get up. And starts meowing incessantly to make me get up with her. Because she doesn't like being by herself.
Of course, while she doesn't like being by herself, she also doesn't really like uh, whenever you pet her too much or anything. So she wants you to be up and around so she can, I guess, hear you up in the house. But at the same time, <laughs> doesn't want you messing with her. Cat logic. I feel like I'm sitting way too close to the screen and because of the extra lights I've gotten here right now, my face is washing out, so I apologize for that. My war is strong. I need to find a better lighting solution that does a good job without overdoing it. And that is surprisingly hard to do. I used to run out of ammo and everything when I first started playing this game. Um, since <laughs> years of playing it and everything, though, you, you get to where you find a gun and you can make it so so strong, like this shotgun here, that I don't I don't use enough ammo in between picking up ammo. Whoa, that was fun. To really uh, stop it. Ah. Hey, hey, hey! No, no. Let's Bad Grenier. Damn it, I still need one. There we are. The relic is open. The relic is open. Now, uh, for those of you who don't know, uh, prime parts are locked away inside relics. You have to crack open the relic uh, to choose a prime part. The good thing about doing this with multiple people is that you get four options instead of just whatever that you would have gotten. So that makes uh, doing it with a, with a group significantly more uh, pleasant because you can try to get what you need. The, uh, the other thing with it, though... is that uh, Prime Parts can be sold for Ducats, and, but Prime Parts are like the only way for you to unlock uh, the Prime Warframes and Prime Weapons. If you don't want to pay for them when they first come out. And, you know, I don't want to pay for that crap, so... <laughs> Yay, the grind! And Warframe is a, a, a grind-heavy game, there's no doubt, but it's a grind-heavy game that is also properly rewarding for your time and effort put into the game, I think. They've done a very good job at keeping that balance. And they've not done a whole lot of that uh, random generation nonsense where it becomes essentially a, a uh, like a slot machine. It's not a, it's not a gambling thing to, uh, that DE is doing. And I really, really, really appreciate that from DE. The fact that they're, you know, while, while obviously they're in it to make money, they, they don't want to sit there and just take from you, so... Anything that you want to get in the game, you can purchase, which is which is nice. Just just straight up find it and, and get it. But uh, like you don't have to, to to purchase anything to be able to uh, to get anything that you want in the game. It just takes you know grinding. Plus, a lot of times, even if you don't get the uh, the part that you're looking for, you can get a part that uh, somebody else is looking for and trade. So. There's ways around that. Welcome to the dojo. Thank you for dropping by. Just doing some early morning uh, Warframe and talking to myself because the uh, chat's not moving yet. <laughs> Tell you guys about the about the game in case you don't know. Hey, howdy, hey, what's up, Lex? I was actually talking about you just a minute ago, how we're, we've been getting you going here on the game. Just chilling and lurking while I get ready for work. I certainly appreciate it. Got to get ready for work so you can go there and walk around and act crazy and make sure to serve all those people so you can have that 10-year-old boy come up and be like, Hey, 
You're Ropa Dog! I love your videos! <laughs> Ooh. Oh my god, it's gonna suck. Nah, you you good at work. Nah, not serving the day, haha. <laughs> Worst job. Worst job. Ooh, Glaive Prime Disc. I don't have that. Worst job in hours uh, shift today. Come on, creeper dude. Get back over here. What's the worst job than, uh, than doing that over there? I mean, uh, are you like... Uh, you have to do the like cleaning the um, pots and pans or something. Continue to defend. You Food running today. Your so you're more a server today. Don't understand why restaurants started doing that, where they have one person take the order and someone else bring it. Because if somebody gets something wrong, it's like you don't want to. You don't want to sit there and talk to the person who's bringing the food. You want, you know, it's like, hey. <laughs> Just dropping off food, changing garbage tables. No guests. That's too bad. It's better when Lex makes the tips. That's how Lex learned to be super friendly. I'm just joking about that. I'm pretty sure you've been super friendly most of your life, Lex. It just seems part of your personality. <laughs> oh, by the way, Lex, forklift. Really, do those I choose? <laughs> yep. By the way, only mods can do that, so uh, not anyone can do that one. That that, that one's uh, just like you, my brother, and that kind of stuff. But that's exclusively a Lex one. special to me I'm special <laughs> of course you are Lex you're awesome <laughs> derp you realize that means if you were a unicorn you'd be a derpicorn that's a unicorn that runs around and says quack <laughs> Don't, don't ask. Uh, that's something that a friend and, and I came up with a long time ago. We thought it was hilarious. A catacorn. Have a glass that says so. Really? I thought your uh, I thought your cup had uh, crazy cat lady written on it. That's it. The relic. Finish your mission and we'll Yeah, take yeah, Lotus. Up, up, up. There's the where's the Yeah. Catacorn in my drinking cup. Ah, okay. What the hell is a catacorn? Is that just a cat with a horn? That seems un unnecessarily uh, invasive. It's like um, saw a little comic somebody made of uh, of God, where it has uh, God talking about how when he made cats and let's make them cute and cuddly and you know make them everybody want to touch them. Let's give them razor claws in their hands. <laughs> By 
By the way, I don't think that uh, cats should be uh, declawed or whatever. Um, it's extremely violent for the cat. And a lot of times they really mess the cat's paws up trying to do that. So, Nope, little Siri has got all of her claws and she does accidentally hurt us with them once in a while. You can tell she's not intending to. She's, you know, playing or whatever, but... Rough is as rough does, you know? Ah, see, Lex, look, Scorpion. <laughs> I've got to look over and check chat, make sure that I'm not missing nothing. Feel bad if I miss some of your guys' posts. I'd like to make sure that I'm. I've got things covered. You guys are friendly enough to come watch me play a game. I should be friendly enough to at least keep you involved and chat with you. <laughs> the calling is like cutting off the uh, joint of your finger. It's terrible. Yeah, I totally agree. Uh, when I first got Siri, you know, two or three people asked me if I was going to do that, and it was like, no, it's that's you're you're essentially mutilating your your animal. You know, it, it's just let the cat be a cat. <laughs> Granted, I, I got her from from like a rescue uh, operation thing, and they already had her uh, neutered before I ever got her, so I didn't have a choice in that one. Why humans seem so insane on trying to control populations of animals. Like, I, I get that there's a, a lot of cats out there and stuff, but, you know, it's... They've been around for a long time. It's not like, uh... Cats are not capable of uh, surviving on their own. Not that I think that it's right to, you know, if you, if you get a pet, you should take care of the pet. Not drive down the street one day and decide that they're more of a hassle than it's worth and throw them out of your car. People who do that, you're bastards. You don't do that shit. That's, it's not right. Domesticated animals have, have a significantly harder time with that. It's... Anyone who does that is seriously a piece of shit. <laughs> In my opinion, you should always spay and neuter. It improves the lifespan and can prevent certain cancers. It can prevent cancers? I was not aware of that. I guess that makes sense. Like cervical cancer and that kind of stuff, but... I don't know, it just seemed crazy, it always seemed crazy to me, people trying to to do that. It's like anyone who gets a, a boy dog immediately wants to, you know, chop off his testicles, and it's like, like, I don't know, it just seems so, so cruel to me. Not that I really have any interest in, in, you know, trying to find a cat and breed it or something, or find a dog and breed it so that I can, you know, sell it as puppies or, or kittens or whatever, but just like, I don't know. How would you like it if, like, uh, there, there were giants who bought people and they went around neutering us? That, that's the way that I look at it. <laughs> I sure as hell wouldn't appreciate that. That was a close one. Females from going into heat. Males, it can also reduce aggression. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Like my male rat. <laughs> Both of your rats are super cute that you posted there on Discord. Extraction is ready. Unless handle more of the enemy. <coughs> And if he wasn't, I couldn't have him because my other five rats are ladies. <laughs> ah, so he'd be uh, he'd be the talk of the town there on the rat cages. 
15 babies at a time. Yeah, but rats are, I don't know, they're, they're less so to me. Uh, I mean, eh. <laughs> By the way, Lex, I think you'll like this shirt. It says chinchillin. It's got a little chinchilla on it. <laughs> Oh, shut up, stream elements. <laughs> yeah, I actually, uh, I found this shirt at the, um, what do you call it? Uh, the five and below, or five below. Hi. Bye. Do, 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 do. Uh, yes, this one again. Man, I have no idea why I got that stupid song stuck in my head uh, from <laughs> way back when. But for some reason in my head right now, um, I think I think it was just where I was talking about the, the boys uh, last night from, from my ex. But I got that stupid song from one of the little kids' shows in my head, that hot potato, hot potato, 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 potato. <laughs> and I can't, it, it's it's looping in there, and I can't get it out. My work shift is boring. Yeah, five below, my bro, mom, and dad all work for them. <laughs> my shirt is booby streamer appropriate. Ah, you wearing the low cut thing today? <laughs> Bro and mom worked in stores. My dad worked for them as a side job uh, for Harbro taking candy orders. Really? That's neat. I've never worked four or five below, but I, I've I've been in there a number of times. Sometimes they got some really cool stuff. It's like a uh, like a better dollar store, in my opinion. Which isn't exactly true, but I mean, essentially, it's you know, anything in there is five dollars or less. There are void fissures in the area. Use these to crack open a relic. I was unaware that you had a brother, Lex. That's neat. Uh, you have any other family, or he works too much? Your dad or your brother? Oh, that's not a good sign. Three minutes in and somebody's already down. That's what I mean, Lex. You, you were doing fantastically at the game in comparison to other people that have been playing for a long time. <laughs> of course, Space Mom is yelling at us. Keep fighting. Find more reactant. I know the job, Mom. Your dad works too much. Yeah, younger bro, and that's just the two of us. I'm ML... MLG Pro Biatch. I should know what MLG means, but I don't. <laughs> I probably will what you tell me, but uh, off the top of my head, I have no idea what that, what that abbreviation is meant to intend. Major League Gaming, ah. Would never have, have guessed that. <laughs> Anyone who does watch uh, this recording later, though, you guys should head on over to YouTube and uh, check out Ropa Dog's channel. It's R-O-P-O-D-O-G. And uh, say hi to Lex once in a while. She is awesome. 
Very friendly, plays Fallout, uh, The Sims, Fable 2. And now uh, Warframe, although I don't think she's planning on streaming that on her channel necessarily because it's on the PlayStation, but still. Uh, War theme, oh, ah, War theme. War Thunder is another one of those games that's cross-compatible between the PlayStation and uh, the computer. So that's another one we can play together, Lex. Not sure how we would get the the voice to work on that we one, but we figure it out. Oh, of course, I give uh, all you guys shout outs every channel, <laughs> every time. Um, that's part of the fun of doing this is being able to to throw some support back to your friends. Like, hey, while you're at this, go check out this other awesome person. It's also another good way to keep up with me is find out what my friends are doing because chances are if I'm not streaming, I'm lurking in their in their streams unless it's uh, while I'm at work. Morning ish, everyone. What's up, Dubsy? Glad you got up. Just uh, unlocking some stuff here on Warframe. Wanted to uh, have a little bit of fun, see what I could get going. That's it. You the relic. Not really trying to Finish accomplish anything today, just grinding. Inside. Button. Okay. By the way, you have no idea how annoying that Smurfs movie can be until you have children around all the time. And then they want to walk around and sing nothing but that la la la, la la la, song of the Smurfs. Oh, good lord. <laughs> when that movie first came out while I was uh, still with my ex, I fucking hated that. It is, you know, begging the kids, please stop singing that. Kids are annoying me already, you know this. <laughs> I know, but I'm not just talking to you, Dubsy. Extraction is ready. Unless you handle more of the enemy. Yeah, let's see. Oh, hell yeah! Helios Prime Cerebellum. That's all. I mean, Cerebrum. I added a whole bunch of uh, <laughs> letters that weren't there. <laughs> nah, but we're definitely choosing that because that's the last thing I needed to be able to do that again. Why do people come for one round? Are you guys staying or going? We're going, I guess. Gotta leave soon. Well, I do hope that work at least goes quickly for you, Lex. Uh, sorry that you do have to work today. Both brain stuff. <laughs> Invite you. Oh, you want to play too? All right. I will shoot you a message. As soon as I get rid of this group that I'm, I'm currently with. Bye. Bam. Gang's all here. <laughs> hey, hey, what's up, Guap? How you doing, my friend? Just doing a little bit of uh, grinding, opening up some relics today. Let's get uh, Guap and... I don't know if you're going to do voice chat or not, Dubs. I know that sometimes uh, you do, sometimes you don't, but... I'll throw you one anyways. Oh, absolutely, Lex. <laughs> you didn't lag behind. You were you were kicking ass. All right. Fox trot. Let's go ahead and get uh, Guap in here as well. Could not deliver invitation to Guap. Why? Oh, says you're offline. Okay. 
It shows you in the game, but whatever. <laughs> we'll go uh, do some more of this because why the hell not? I got my little one right now, but give me a second. All right, no problem, Guap. For that, I get fired. <laughs> no, we don't want you to get fired, Lex. Here, uh, we'll give Guap a minute and let him catch up. Get his little girl situated. He posted a picture of her in the, uh, the Discord also. And she is an adorable little thing. Hate working. Uh, poor thing doesn't want to work. Everybody hates working. Hell, I hate working. I, you have no idea how much I would love for this to be my job. To, to be able to do this. Like, I realize that that's quite a ways away from being a possibility, but still, uh, if that, that, that would be the dream, that would be the dream for me. To be able to sit here and entertain you guys for several hours a day and uh, have that kind of fun. Guap! <laughs> What's up, man? Hashtag Guap Nation! Guap you guys Nation. definitely need to go uh, like and check out Guap's channel as well. Uh, it's Wolfman Guap. 97? 87. 87. Yeah. <laughs> I always just call you Guap, so I haven't really looked at your <laughs> your name that much. But Guap is yeah, awesome. You guys definitely need to check him out. After you guys left, I grinded for a little bit. But, uh... Bye, Lex. Oh, Lex is going to work. If my snickerdoodle stops by and says hi for me. Yeah, 87 was a good year. <laughs> 87 was a good so. year. <laughs> yeah. I think that's why. Uh, I didn't uh, think a barrel tear would have left by now, man. I thought I could squeeze in some some stuff in the morning, but. Uh, oh, well. Did, is he already out? That, I really wanted to get those mods, though. Wow. I was just wanting that one mod, the, the extra serration oh. for the gun. Yeah, they're like elemental ones. I was like, man. It's, I already have like two or three copies of the one prime one that he had, so I can wait. Yeah, the flow, yeah. So He leaves early in the on. morning for us. Damn it. He left. I did get the Prisma cleavers, so I'm happy with that, you know? <laughs> yeah, I, I looked at those. I know a lot of people really like the Prisma stuff. I just, I'm, I'm not, I'm not particularly crazy about it. Yeah, I've been stacking on like. Uh, oh, uh, Guap! Things. I did just get uh, the Carrier Prime, uh, or maybe one Carrier. Was it Helios? I got one of those uh, Cerebrums that I think you were missing. Well, I'm actually, I, I think I had the full set. Actually. Oh, I remember you, but, you uh, mentioning that you needed one of them yeah, the other day. Let me check, though, because I know I will... No, I do have it. I actually actually crafted my Helios Prime. Okie dokie. Never mind, then. Yeah, I'll keep but I do it. appreciate it, uh, you know, looking out. As soon as it came up, I was like, hey, I'll select that, because Guap was needing it. <laughs> yeah. Thanks, though. I appreciate it. Like, I, I, know, I know I came about it somehow, and I was like, finally, I get crafted. And, yeah. I, mean, uh, I do have all the pieces for it, so if anybody ever needs a Helios Prime, maybe we can give them the parts. Alright. Yeah. Alright, I'm bringing the... What are we throwing here? What are you throwing in there? Uh, I don't even have any idea what I threw in there. I just throw in random ones. I did a Meso V1. V1? You know what? I'm just going to get throw a little Radiant out there, see how, how it goes. Let's hope we get lucky, right? There you go. I don't know what he's gonna throw in there, but hopefully he'll throw something in there. Yeah, yesterday we like I was throwing me and um my friend Courtney, right? Uh, we we kept throwing in like radiance, and the other two people that we're playing with, like the randoms, weren't throwing anything interesting, even in an Axie survival. I'm like, damn, man, we're you know we were the only ones getting like good loot, but then it got to a <laughs> point like. We weren't getting, so after like three or four rounds, we just started like, ah. Oh, wait. Big squad. Oh, big squad. What the? I think what? he canceled. That's not. He didn't pick a relic. 
don't know who that was. Okay. That was my uh, my brother. Uh, he's the one who's chatting in the uh, in there right now. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Uh, yo, I'm so excited for my PlayStation 4. Oh my god, like I'm waiting. Like I'm, I can't wait till Monday. It's gonna be so good. Yeah, I, I certainly, uh, certainly like mine. Yeah. Do you not have, uh, like, do you not have Meso Relic stubs or what's going on there? Did you hit uh, escape by accident? It happens sometimes. Yeah. All right, so the radiant that I'm throwing in has Frost Chassis, has the Ember Prime Blueprint, and the Worm Systems. Nice. Well, let's hope we get something there, you know? Accident, oh. yeah. <laughs> what is this? This is a defense? Okay. Woo. You know, I, you know what I, I tend to do? Whenever I get a new weapon, I'm leveling it up. Um... The burning I always put I put Berserker, Blood Blood Rush I think it is called and Fury Prime Fury. So I just like it's like maximum speed. <laughs> About that. I've seen people do um, Volt that way where they uh, they get him going for maximum speed. <laughs> Some of the people who yeah. who, who do that. My God, their vault just 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 zips across the entire level at, at, at just incredible speeds. Yeah, the reason I do it on, on my melee weapons is because even though it'll do much damage, I can get more DPS off it. So. Oh, I, I love uh, <laughs> Berserker Stone. <laughs> no, I love uh, the um, whatever you call it the. Berserker on my uh, on my sword because it, yeah. uh, the more that you hit enemies and get criticals, the faster it goes all the way up to uh, seventy five percent faster. Yeah, and that just that rocks that that is just rocks. <laughs> Especially when you're going now? up against the infested. Let me see. Oh look, well I don't know. My, you see my knowledge has six thousand fifty. You have the oh. health thing max. Yeah, and I have the. Um, I think I do. I'm not sure. Maybe I'm missing like one point. Uh, uh, you obviously have it higher than I do. Mine isn't maxed. I've got four thousand hit points, and that that's more than enough. You probably have bit more power than I do. Mine is like strictly defensive. I do. I did it because I like hacking and slashing. So when I run around meleeing. I also need to put that life link on there, so I can, you know, at least heal when I do mailing, and I can hold back on some of the health. You know? Woo! Get on the elevator. So I have no more power. I should have uh, should have hopped on and gotten my uh, dog out of uh, that I pulled out of stasis last night. Should have brought that with me in this round. Didn't think about it. Oh yeah. You can't copy that. Uh, I or... think I can. Uh, I think I, I, I can still do the um, the DNA copy of that. Yeah. Cause if anything, like maybe I don't know how it works, but I know if you get you, trade, you can you only do it twice. Trade. Like copy. Yeah, yeah, you can copy his DNA code twice, and then you can you know trade it to two people or to one person to give them a higher chance of getting a dog like yours. Nice. Yeah, cause I have the, my, cause my um, my infected Kuro, he looks small though. Yeah, I got the big beefy one. <laughs> yeah, I was like, man, you're a tiny little dude. He doesn't even look that cool. I was like, nah, not so. Well, mine's also wearing the uh, the prime Kuro armor. Yeah, it looks so dope, man. I was like, man, I, I didn't know. Like, I seen the big Kubros, but the only reason I stick with the Kavad is because of the loot. You know? Yeah, the loot is definitely helpful. They have that fortune. I, I just I, I like the I like the Kubros better, and then when they they snuck that uh, infested Kubro in, it's like, oh, hoo, hey, look at that! That looks badass. Yeah. And for a while there, there was a uh, a glitch you could do to get a weird cross between a Kubro and a Kavat. Mm-hmm. 
Well, all right then. Um, <laughs> and the, uh, the Kubro and Kavat mixture created this weird, like, shadow creature. And, uh, you know, that, that was really, really cool to see. But you had to, uh, to start by trying to do a Kavat and then, like, switch over. They, they fixed the glitch now, but whoever got one apparently got to keep it, I think. At least that's what the video was saying that I watched. Oh, and it was wow. like, oh man, I wish I would have known about that when it was a thing. I would have one of those just to have something that nobody else has, you know? Yeah. I actually saw a guy who had the Excalibur Prime. I never seen anybody with it. Well, they, they only a... exist on PC. Uh, nobody on the PlayStation yeah. can get one. Yeah, I was watching a stream and he had it. It's on. a oh, founders only thing, which I mean, it's cool that they've they've kept their word about that to the founders of the game. And from uh, what I've heard from people who actually own own one, you know, it's like not even that big of a thing. Like the Excalibur Prime was the very first Prime they ever did. You know, I mean, it, it's essentially just a, a, like a fancy prototype. head on Excalibur. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It, it, even a regular like prime, primes are not that. I mean, I know they're, they they have more a little bit more stats, but. They don't make a huge difference. If you, you can still do a decent build on a regular. Yeah, I, I would still. I would love to get a hold of uh, the Umbra whenever it comes out. The Umbra Excalibur. Yeah. Totally want to do that. I, I was like so close to like spending over a hundred bucks on platinum, but I was like, let me hold off. <laughs> you know. Yo, these cleavers though. I have a bunch of Prisma weapons, which I will do like nasty builds on at some point. But since I'm only uh, right now, I'm just leveling up a bunch of weapons. Ah, uh, damn! I bought my similar. I don't want that. Mm. What else? What else do I have? Let's see, you phone Oh, what the hell am I using? Enjoy, guys. Just dropped you guys ammo, shields, and um, energy. Of course, burning with us doesn't know that, but he's not listening. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I had the piranha. I'm the level 30. I can finally get rid of it. Literally, I'm starting to build all the dual weapons. I'm just kind of getting through all these. They're not that bad, though. Quit shooting the cryopod. I think they must have adjusted how the focus system works because I've been earning more focus than normal lately. Focus? Probably. And it's a good thing because the focus system was, was so heavily weighed to make it impossible for you to earn anything. Do you choose to leave now? Yeah, I only have that on my false pipe. Well, what would you know? Look at that Frost Prime. Yep, I'll take the Frost Prime because that's in the vault. <laughs> These guys are like, well, this guy must be dumb if he doesn't want to go in. Oh, I'm about to say. Oh, you can mess out on that. The Burning Stone. The Burning Guap. Oh, I'm going to throw another rare one out there. The Burning hey, Guap. <laughs> G1, do I have a G1? G1. I throw that C3 out there. That's the Galantine. I do not have it. I do have a C3. Ooh. Okay. Okay. I apparently just barely made the cutoff for that. <laughs> time run. They should add more time towards that because sometimes they don't give. They shouldn't allow us to start. Yeah. 
Yeah, if, if you if you if you chose to stay on, it should give you a chance to for everyone to select a relic. Yeah, and if they don't want they don't have a relic, give them the option to exit and not be you know and keep their loot. But yeah. Yo, did, you, did, did you notice this waypoint? Yeah, I saw. It. I'm not sure who that is. <laughs> that's uh, Guap. Oh, that's Guap. <laughs> that's Guap. That looks like me though. <laughs> That is wow. How'd you get a custom, you. uh, how'd you get a custom glyph? Well, it's not me, though. That's somebody else. That looks cool as shit. <laughs> that looks odd. It looks like me. He has a full beard. He has a man bun. Pretty ripped. Some tattoos. I mean, wow. Who put that? The, the other guy, the burning, the burning storm. Yeah. Oh, look. You can put he puts a picture of his icon. Mm. I have one too. Is that infinite? Or is it like a one-time use? Uh, for the glyph, it's infinite. Is it? That's why I never use mine. Damn. You can use the uh, uh, you can use glyphs as much as you want to. Oh man, I'm holding out to my forever thinking that it was a one-time thing. No, if you look back on on the other the other side, he put one on both sides up there, exactly nice. opposite of where your your waypoint was. And Glop is gonna be using his glitch. Make sure you catch this. Guap Guap oh, posting in chat. The glyph looks like me. I'm gonna, I'm gonna give him a kiss. He looks so sexy. It's a bye guy. Wap. Wap likes a bye guy. Uh, it just means you need to go to Sabai Guy's channel and figure out what uh, the password is for his glyph. Well, what do you mean? He's a streamer? Uh, well, yeah, obviously he's got to be, he's got to be one of the people that, who, uh, who worked for, uh, you know, who's a partner with them, with DE. Oh, so, oh. so that's a, okay. that's a glyph that once you punch it, punch in the password, it'll put it into your inventory and you can use it as much as you want. No way. Or you could just ask that guy if he knows the password for it and then write it down before we leave the match. I want to start. I would use that one too. Wolfman Glap. Guap, Guap, just taking that's credit it. for it. Fuck yeah, that's Guap. <laughs> that's Guap. Okay. Nobody I knows that. I don't that. care that it's that is actually supporting somebody else. That's Guap right there. That looks like me. Unless I come up with my own glyph, but it'll be somewhere along the same lines, you know? I'll be wearing like a flannel shirt instead. There's not a global oh, one. He gives yeah. out codes, though. So yeah, like I said, you just need to kind of check out his channel, and next time he gives out one of the codes, snatch yeah. it. And what would you input that code? Usually it's like a 13-digit code you put in uh, up at the terminal in your computer. Um, I've gotten free guns and stuff because of what DE gives out sometimes. Yeah, I didn't know that. Is it in the actual PlayStation market, like where you redeem codes? No, no, it's, it's it's right there at uh, in the shop on uh, in, in the orbiter. Oh, it's a special in-game code. Oh. If you play enough Warframe and stuff, that, that DE notices you and makes you a partner with them, I'm sure they'd make you your own uh, glyph. They, they've done with everybody else. I would like to though, you know, considering, I mean, if I could actually get a decent setup and do it in the next few years, then I would love that, you know. You have to have a minimum of 2,000, uh, not subscribers, but like followers at least. Oh, so you're like what, 100 away? Uh, no, I think, 
I only have a hundred, but hundred seventeen, I think. But, uh, you need at least two thousand followers. So, long way to be a partner with with um with Warframe. Yeah, that's the requirement. One of the requirements. But I mean, it's, but that's for those people who who dedicated dedicated to play Warframe. I love Warframe as a game, but it's not the only game that I want to play, you know? I, I like being a variety streamer. Yeah, but they, they don't stream every day, though. That's the thing. They, they stream occasionally. Well, yeah, yeah. But still, so, you know... Like, just... anybody could do that, you know? Like, you probably do it two days a week. You'll stream, like, uh, probably, like, three or four hours. A lot of them, though, they're streaming sp uh, special builds that they've come up with, or... Uh... They're sitting there doing stuff. They don't like actually stream like the actual gameplay much anymore. I've noticed. Yeah. And to me, it's like I don't want to just look at your builds. I want to actually st let me see you use this thing. You know. We're getting that quota next week, though. I know one of the devs mentioned that they're gonna need uh, the wisps, plenty of those for some reason. Might need those to craft there. I've been pretty lucky at getting the Wisps doing the uh, the hardest mission on there uh, as yeah, the they... mission rewards. I, I get those two Wisps all the time, so I'm not too worried about the Wisps. I got like 50 right now. <laughs> well, what do you know? A oh, Seren Prime Blueprint. crap. <laughs> Go out throwing all the good relics. Yeah, I'll just sell that Saren Prime one. I've already got two. <laughs> yeah. I guess so. Let's see. I have one more Radiant, but I don't want to throw that out there. Maybe I should. Maybe I should. Maybe I should. I'll be right back. My daughter needs to take a piss. I gotta supervise her. <laughs> Thanks, Guap. We totally needed to hear that on the chat. Hey, uh, Justin, I don't know if you have the Kavat incubator upgrade or not, but it's over here if you want it. <laughs> I don't have enough followers, but once I set up, it's gonna be dope. Cause I, I got everything, but I got the hashtag. I even got Guap Squad, Guapy Pops. You know, I got a bunch of little, uh, little um, little hashtags that can help me out. Man, I'm I'm getting so close to uh, being able to be. Uh... Be affiliate. I mean, I still have uh, the average watchers to go, but um, I've not even been streaming for for uh, you know a full month yet, and I'm already at 44 follows. So I appreciate the the fuck out of everybody who's been following my channel and uh, showing support. You guys are, are just awesome. Yeah, man. So I was, I I had some help too because <clears throat> I don't know multiple communities and um, they'll they'll tune in and raid me and people will follow me. There's also... Yeah, I finally figured also, out the raid command, and uh, I, I've raided two different channels now after my streams. But it's like some of my friends, they're, they're not streaming whenever I get done, so it's just like, well, thank you guys for watching, I, I've got nowhere to send you. <laughs> yeah. You always want to send them somewhere, just to give them the follows, but not like, you know. Yeah, I uh, I raided um, I think uh, John McVon yesterday. Oh yeah, John, he's doing like GTA or something, and, right? Yeah, uh, well, no, he's playing uh, Saints Row uh, One, oh. which is the closest one that they had to like a GTA actual clone. Uh, Saints Row Two, they really found their their stride, and the game became just hilarious, where they quit taking themselves so seriously. 
Yeah, I had this girl that got me playing that game for a little bit, and I just couldn't do it, you know? I don't know which one it was. I but fell, I fell in love with Saints Row 2, and, and ever since then I've been a huge fan. This one that I played, which I still have, and she got me to play it, it was free because I downloaded it on the PS Plus. And uh, you start off, and it's just like, like hell on earth, you know? It's like a bunch of weird, like, devil cops everywhere. Oh, uh, you're talking mm -hmm. about uh, Gat Out of Hell. I guess. That's where uh, Johnny Gat somehow, I forget how, gets tossed down into hell and has to fight the devil. Yeah. Johnny Gat is freaking just, awesome. Uh, he's like months, he's the though. number number two for uh, for the boss of uh, uh, some of weird things. monster trucks and you can fly. You got like these devil wings or something. I don't I don't wings. I don't know. Wow, this is so intense right now. Like, <laughs> you know, I don't even. I never played a game like that. I think I, I still have that. Uh, I, I should re-download that. Uh, that game's a lot of fun. It's 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 over the top ridiculous. Yeah. I'm pretty sure I've got I get it. it. Maybe, it's, maybe it's, I don't. Maybe I put it on a button like, system. Because I'm not into like GTA games, so that that kind of like just falls around the same, you know, in a ridiculous yeah. way too. But I just couldn't do it, man. Yeah. Like I tried to play it with my friend, but she, she likes those games. But that's because she plays. That's the only thing she plays, like GTA. And most of the girls I know just play GTA. So, you know, I gotta play multiple games, and there's only so much I can invest. Oh, I, I hear you there. My nephew really wants me to download and play um, the Dragon Ball Z Fighters game with him, and it's like I, I would I, love to, but I, I don't have the extra, you know, sixty bucks to throw around right now. Uh, just wait for a deal, man, because it's not worth sixty bucks. It's it's a great game. The story, the main, the storyline sucks. Storyline always uh, sucks in Dragon Ball games. It's the dope. exact same thing every time. Yeah, no, but this was really good though. Cause fighting, it's amazing. Like if you like Marvel vs. Capcom and things like that. Like, hey, oh, Scarlet, yeah. welcome to the stream. Thank you so much for dropping by. Okay. I certainly appreciate it. <laughs> Okay, I'm tell Guap to stop using the Sinnoh like, Simulator. It's killing everything. <laughs> the Simulator is just sucking all these weapons. Mm. Useless as well. It makes the loot Killing easier them. to pick up, actually. Yeah, just around for a few minutes before I go to work. Oh, I certainly appreciate you dropping by. Uh, Lex was here just a little bit ago uh, before she had to go, too. You guys are awesome. Thank you so much for showing the, the support to the channel before you guys have to go to work and stuff. I guess it's, I guess it's the garbage, right? By the way, uh, I seriously, that painting that you had the other day of the, the, the tree that with the face on it and stuff, you said you painted when you made Bob Ross? I want that. That That is hilarious and amazing. Bob Ross. So, you know they have, they have channels on that on Twitch? It's ridiculous how many people are spamming the chat, yo. It's how like thousands of people. Yeah, it's pretty much whenever Cuta Savage shows up, generally the chat explodes for a bit. Yeah. He is a celebrity, though. <laughs> yeah, she's always doing that hashtag celebrity status. I didn't catch her stream, man. I feel so bad, but like, you know, I was with my daughter. Yeah. I told like, I no, hope no, I, I'm, I do I'm sure thing. she understands, you know? I've talked to her several times since it. Some people are giving her some uh, some shit because she kept uh, all of her subscribers and didn't do face cam. And it's like, well, fuck them. Even if you lose them, you don't need them. You know, you don't need that kind of negativity in your life. Get no, that crap. Wait, wait, they took, wait, wait, they were taking, just taking people's subscribers and doing it how it happened? That was, that was I, I'm extremely impressed by what she's been able to pull off in, in such a short amount of time. Right? All right. All you have to say is she's a celebrity, cutie. Hey, celebrity. hey, Nikki! Welcome to the welcome to the channel. Glad you could drop by. This is uh, Warframe. What me uh, Guap is actually was with us last night, and uh, so is uh, Detroit Dubs, who's in here with us. 
he's not on what, on what? chat, but um, we were the ones who were playing with Lex last night, teaching her uh, how to use the game. Yes, there, but... This game is a, a lot of fun to play. It can get a little intense because the controls are, are kind of crazy. Uh, ooh, nice. Nice. Damn, I needed that. <laughs> Thank you, Dubsy. <laughs> Everyone went for what Dubs got. <laughs> yeah, the last two I... rounds, people were picking my shit. <laughs> oh, we're leaving? All right, we can leave. Hey, give me a quick second here to check up on my daughter. Thanks for hanging out. Try to be friendly to the other players here since I don't know uh, the Burning Stone personally. <laughs> Good game, guys. She said I might like it. It is It is a very fun game, uh, Nikki. Uh... <laughs> <coughs> It can be a little uh, a little intense, um, especially because there, there's so much going on. But once you get used to the controls, I mean, you you are essentially a uh, I mean, you're a robotic super ninja, and you're being controlled by one of these guys. But uh, so you get to be a robotic super ninja, and everything you do is just uh, you know it, uh, super impressive and super tankful to uh, to the enemies. So it's it is a it's a very fun game to play, um, and there are points where it gets really hard. I'm going to make sure to equip the Kubro before we go, because I see him sleeping up there. What up, D'Artagnan? All right, ability use three hundred and thirty one. Holy crap, Dubs. <laughs> Did it really say that? Let's see here. Abilities used. Yeah, 331. I used one. <laughs> Pickup count 943. I was dominating oh, there. What's going on here? Just reading what, uh, what Justin posted. That's my infinite pull build. Yeah, without a doubt. I like how you get to move around. Looks so fluid. Thanks for the explanation. Absolutely. Lex has not quite figured out the movement just yet, uh, so it's kind of funny watching her, you know, get around because she's still just running. And it's like, look, if you if you jump, slide, jump, slide, the move that they tried to give you as much control of the movement of your character as possible in this game, so that you really feel like you are a space ninja. <laughs> <laughs> like a guap. Like a guap. By the way, uh, Nikki, this here is my my uh, buddy that you hear talking, uh, Wolfman Guap. Uh, he he's uh, met him here on Twitch. He's he's an awesome guy as well. Thank you, thank you. I appreciate it. <laughs> I appreciate it very much. She's Funny. saying hello there. <laughs> <laughs> the piranha's done. You guys want to do some more of uh, that same thing, or do you want to try something? Uh, another one of the ones. They're all like mobile defenses, besides the one defense. Uh, we can do another type <clears throat> of defense, like the mezzo. I don't have that many. I've got a. I threw all my radio stuff. Yeah, I should. Uh, let me go and make a couple radiant. Yeah, Mad Scarlet's in the up house. My Detroit Dub's in the house. Nikki's in the house, or the dojo, whatever you guys want to say. <laughs> Welcome, Jojo. Welcome to the dojo. I am your master, Lord Kijaro. You will learn the ways of the ninja. <laughs> <laughs> I can make ten of these things flawless, uh, radiant, whatever. Ooh, so you got the nine hundred. I've got a thousand. Um, just do the ones that are like, probably, you know, the thing that's best to use and throw it in there. I'm just doing them kind like of randomly. 
<laughs> if you got some Zephyr ones, man, please throw them out there. I need the Zephyr uh, Prime. I don't think I have any of the Zephyr ones. <laughs> right? I have the blueprints, too. Right. I need to get some more, um... What a radiant. Alright, I can do one more. I think there's a Bam. weapon. Alright, we got ten now. All right, quit go bopping back and forth. Damn, I need that Cronin, those Cronin, the Cronin blade and handle, man. That's not... Oh boy. <coughs> man, That's I wish I could get rid of this damn cough. Man, I appreciate you guys coming by and stopping by the stream so much. Thank you so, so much for being here to hang out with me while I play games. It means the world to me. Oh, by the way, uh, Diggy, friend. check this out. Got the Chin Chillin' shirt on today. <laughs> <laughs> little Chin Chilla oh, on it. Good times. I don't have the Dulles Canas. Hmm. Oh, thank you so much. I appreciate that. I hope this, uh, the cough is the only thing that's stuck around. Everything else, uh, <laughs> everything else hasn't been too bad. Before you start it, let me quickly check something. Hold on, sorry. Hey, no problem, take Before your time. Yeah, I, like, uh, I got a lot of different, people. uh, goofy shirts that I like, um, like I have one, uh, that I wore the other day, and, you know, it's real big on it, it says, nope, not today. And uh, I got one that I intend to wear to a party at some point. I, I don't really go to parties. I get invited once in a while, but I don't really go. <laughs> so if I uh, if I do ever end up going, I'm, I got this shirt that says, uh, I'm sorry I'm late, but I didn't want to come. That's me. <laughs> I get uh, sick constantly around those kids. Just over strep throat. Yeah, that's uh, that's definitely got to be a thing. Kids are little germ factories. I'm starting to think I have that myself. <laughs> it's kind of late to think about that after you've had one there, Guap. <laughs> yeah, because I, I don't know. I have something in my throat. I need to go get it checked out, man. I think it's either I got something from my daughter or it's when I actually choked on some food a while back. and I Just like me with something. parties. Yeah, I, I'm not crazy about parties. Uh, I mean... All, all, all more power to the people who want to do them. I, I just, I don't know. I'm, I'm, I'm so much more of a loner, and uh, it's like my Meyer Briggs personality type is an INTP. Uh, you guys can look that up if you want to. Uh, not exactly the most social creatures, but, uh, you know, for whatever reason, this seems so natural to me to sit here and, and playing games to having fun with you guys. Which is, is is strange because I am so very introverted uh, in like my personal life. Yeah, I need to go get that throat checked. <sighs> and it's just about time for me to get a haircut again. It's starting to get out of out of hand. <laughs> you should have seen I, me yesterday. Yeah. I buzz it down to uh, to where it's like a, a nice buzz cut, and then I. I Wait till it grows back out to about where it is, and then I buzz it down again. You only have to have like three haircuts a year that way. It's fantastic. <laughs> <laughs> Yay, yeah, short only, hair. Only the sides, but like yesterday when I was at the pool, with my daughter like. You know, I'm not you know, either super introverted. That if that's what out. you like, do it. Absolutely, that is, that is... Nikki. Now, it's, it's, you know, I don't I don't hate on anybody who, who's uh, who's different than me or whatever, who's extroverted and wants to be out there, but I have had uh, girlfriends in the past and stuff that um, they were extremely extroverted and like want to go out and do things, you know, want to go uh, out to like clubs and dancing and everything, and that's just so not for me. That, that's just such a stress on my shoulders. <laughs> like I like going out once in a while or something, but. Jeez, you know, it does not need right to be here. every Jeez, weekend or something. Is... You know, it's go out, have a good time, watch a movie, have have dinner, but it doesn't need to be a group event either. Yeah, it's a, you can go out, eat, and have a drink real quick for whatever you're with, and that's it. Keep it light. 
long as we have balance. Dewey Che Tuzo, my friend. <laughs> By the way, the reason I say Dewey Che Tuzo instead of to each their own is I, I was uh, uh, lurking around Facebook one day and I saw a, uh, a post on there where it was talking about people who had heard uh, people sayings wrong for like most of their lives. And that one was my favorite. Uh, they were talking about how they always heard people say to each their own, but they always misheard it and thought they were saying something in French, you know, Dewey Che to Zo. And, uh, you know, I, I just I thought that was so funny, so I, I, I adopted it into my vocabulary, so I say it now. To each their own. I use that a lot, actually. <laughs> Go ahead and adopt it. Guap Dewey Che to Zo. Touche. No, not touche. <laughs> Dewey Che to Zo. There you go. I'll come up on my own. <laughs> It's the guap apocalypse. Yeah. What guap was your uh, your guap chicken or whatever that you came up with? Uh, oh the guap. Uh, I only go like once or twice a year for my hair. Yeah, not me either. Maybe go see a movie and dinner, but most of the time, I like to relax in my PJs at home. Hell yes, Nikki, that is the way to live. I am wearing my <laughs> pajama pants right now. <laughs> That's another thing I love about streaming is, you know, you don't have to, to worry about from here up. <laughs> as long as you guys find me entertaining and like hanging out here, that's what's important. Yeah, if you guys are looking for someone super skilled in games, you're probably at the wrong channel. If you want someone who's going to fail horribly and laugh at themselves, welcome to the dojo. There's a banshee here. Banshee, banshee. That's the one that does the sound wave, right? Yeah. But we can nerf, so she's not. Especially like she's only good at like low level missions. If you actually bring her to a, one of these, it doesn't really do much. She used to be super effective in missions like these, like even on uh, that higher level one uh, on that. I can't even think what the hell that planet was called right now. Woo! Go PJs! Inaros Boom! <laughs> well, this Inaros is a butcher. You know they should have like more quests, like creepy oh. quests, kind of like Harold. All three of us in Inaros. Really dark story. <laughs> There's three Inaros and a Banshee. Oh, that's awesome. Naros never dies. Oh, he does. It's just very rare. Yeah, that uh, Gondal I was telling you about is what my brother uses as his uh, melee weapon. And uh, that thing is so damn powerful. It's it's very much like the uh, the sword being you were using the Galantine. His is actually stronger than mine because he got a uh, a kick-ass ribbon mod that uh, makes it way more powerful. I don't really need that. I don't need any of these. Let's take this then. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Plus because it's worth more. So, Nikki, what do you think about the game overall from what you've watched? Does it look like something that you'd be interested in playing? Only one I use, Gundao. <laughs> Where's my Radiant? There's a Radiant. Bam. I managed to switch it in time. Cover me real quick. Not that I think I will die, but, you know, you never know. Oh no, Guap is going down. <laughs> I 
Throw that down. Bye. Yeah, if we can get you a, uh, a PlayStation, we'd love to play with you uh, online with some games, Nicky. It'd be fun. And Warframe is free, which makes it even better. Like you say, it's got a lot going on, so it'll take me a bit to get past that, but would like to try it. Absolutely. It's part of the fun. And don't worry, I'm a veteran on the game, so keeping people alive is kind of my specialty. <laughs> Would be fun. Absolutely, it would be fun. It'd be great. To me, uh, like that, that right there sounds, you know, sounds like the life. Just being able to, to hang out, and have a good time, laugh ridiculously o over, uh, you know, what's going on. Just, just in enjoying yourself, hanging out with people that, that you care about. You know. I'd much rather, you know, a, a night at home with, uh, with a few close friends or. or, or with that special someone just, you know, cuddle up watching watching a movie on the, on TV or, or playing a video game than, than most other things of going out. To me, that, that sounds much more like an enjoyable evening. <laughs> As an introvert, you know, it's like even with uh, when people do do stuff, it's like, I don't want to go, but I do want to be invited because at least then I know that you guys want me around. <laughs> Hey, and you said you're bad at games. You can keep everyone alive. That's great. Uh, that's right. Oh, absolutely. Uh, Sorry, guys, I'm, I'm bad at thing. most games. Um, this game I've been playing for five years, and like, watch as these guys shoot me and stuff. My health doesn't move. So it all depends on, on the game and, and what you've learned about the game and everything. There's definitely some games I'm better at than others. Like War Thunder is a game that I really have been enjoying playing. But I'm terrible at. <laughs> uh, my buddy uh, Eminem here on um, on uh, what is this place called? Twitch. My buddy Eminem here yeah. on Twitch. Uh, he he's much better at War Thunder than I am. He was watching me play the other day and was telling me that I, I was doing really good. You know, I managed to shoot down four planes or whatever, which, which was impressive for me. But uh, I've watched him, you know, just just go go behind down plane after plane after plane, and it's like, man, do I wish I had that skill level. The only games I'm semi good at is the Fable series. <laughs> oh, take me out. I've actually never played Fable. I, I wanted to when it first came out, but it's always been. Uh, I think it's been one of those Xbox exclusives, and I, I've pretty much been a PlayStation guy. But I remember looking at it when the Fable, when the original Fable came out, and I really wanted to play it. it. Looked like it'd be a lot of fun. Any idea if that's true, Glop? Is is that an Xbox exclusive or? The what? Sorry. The uh, game called Fable. I'm pretty sure that's an Xbox exclusive. Yes. Uh, I actually missed that game. If I ever end up getting an Xbox, I'd love to play it. I, I but it, it's not been something I've had the opportunity to up until this a, point. It was a, I think it was a, a great introduction during that time. I, I think they had the Elder Scrolls, um, Morrowind or Oblivion, but um, dude, Oblivion, like, that's my game. I love I Elder Scrolls Oblivion. Get out of the pit. I don't think the competition, but it was good, man. You know? Great story. I miss it though. I think they, the last thing they made was like a VR type, like first person, and it didn't work out too well for them. <laughs> a, a, a VR fable? I don't know what. Well, it wasn't a VR. It was like first person, like. It's like I would like to try the VR games. I just I'm afraid that, it, that they would end up giving me a headache, like the uh, the 3D glasses at the movies. I, I hate going to watch 3D movies because it just ends up. I would like to get a VR though, just so I can be able Bye, to stream Scarlett. with some Thanks of you for guys. Bye, I certainly appreciate it. 
take it easy, man. Got it. Yeah. Yo, I'm kind of stuck inside this pod. Oh. I'm stuck. Ah, oh. there. Finally got out. Uh, by the way, Nikki oh, Lex is a uh, moderator here on my channel. She's already uh, left for now, but uh, she asked for a uh, forklift because I drive a forklift to be a command for her. So I threw that in uh, for her so you can take a look at that. <laughs> <laughs> Only moderators can use that uh, can use that command. But it, it's I, got a, I got offered a job at this warehouse as a um, forklift driver and... They, pay, they want to pay me like $14. I'm like, man, you guys are gonna pay me more, man. Well, 14 is actually not bad to start. I mean, it, they, yeah, uh, I'm not certified to use a forklift, but I've operated heavy equipment, including forklifts. Oh, no, uh, forklifts are not hard to, to use, man. It's hard to use, man. It, it just, it takes a minute to get used to it, is all. It's like a 13 question oh. quiz to get certified. It, it's not hard to do. It's, it's no, all I, I've very used basic forklifts knowledge. like for years. So I've done the sit down and stand up. I use lifts. Even in the construction field, I use like the excavator rollers, loaders. But I don't know. I'm see this warehouse. This warehouse. They want to hire me for assistant uh, manager, but they want me to have the certification. But they might. I might not need it. Just because of my work history. Yeah, most places they offer you to get certified at the place because it's so easy to do. Oh no, yeah. Foster Boy's down. The only reason they do it is because they, it's a liability. You know, if something happens, you know, they want to make sure that, you know, any damages or any... Well, usually any, your certification for Hilo doesn't follow you from one, one job to another. Like, uh, hell yeah, we're taking the Galaxy Prime again. Yeah, yeah, let me get those formas, baby! <laughs> I got like eight formas, <laughs> blueprints. I've got 15 right now. Yeah, nothing good, man, I'm telling you. Grab a forma with just nothing good. We're still battling, or...? <laughs> yeah, you can keep going. Oh, they came on back, yeah. cool. All right, well, I'm going to throw Obi out there. How about that? I'm going to throw a little Oberon. Oh. Continue to defend. You will be Mirage. You don't have Mirage. You have Mirage, right? Or you don't? Uh, Mirage Prime I do have. I haven't used it, oh. but I, I've got it. Oh. Yeah, I, I'm missing Meza. And... Harold. Two Hero. warfare that I don't want to grind for. <clears throat> <coughs> I should have brought my frost prime. Anyway. <laughs> so I can level them up. So, uh... Yeah. Fable, Nikki. What's up with uh, what's up with that? I, like I said, I, I've never played the game, so is that a thing during that time when Fable released or was a pawn release? I think it was called Project Ego, and then they ended up calling it Fable. Now they used to talk highly about the game, saying that it's like you can go into the woods, create your own path. You can be good or evil. You know, you can get married and have kids and all that stuff so like that's what drew a lot of people into the game and the first two fables were pretty memorable yeah i've been watching uh lex uh, rope dog play a little bit of fable 2 um but I, i've I, like i've never even seen play of F fable 1 i just remember when fable 1 came out that i really liked it hey what's up just warframe thank you so much for dropping back by the channel Good to see you, my man. You must just play Warframe and nothing else. <laughs> Kijaro is playing Warframe. Is this all your crew? Uh, not quite sure who uh, Foster Boy is, but yeah. Uh, Gemini here is uh, Guap. He also uh, streams on uh, 
Twitch. Uh, hashtag Guap Nation. If you look him up, he's uh, Wolfman Guap 87. Warframe is one of his favorite games. And um, the other one here with me, uh, who's not actually on the, the chat, is my brother, um, who's a moderator here in my channel, the Detroit Dubs. Guap Nation! <laughs> Guap and yeah, Guap is awesome. Uh, you guys should definitely give him a follow as well. He has a lot more builds oh. and a lot more frames than I do, but I, I certainly love my Anaros and, and a couple of the frames that I've got. <laughs> yeah, I'm there's on Detroit this quest Dubs. To master every weapon. Uh, there's no oh, reason mastery, to do. mastery rank. <laughs> I, I I level stuff up to get the mastery rank, and then I never use it again. Yeah, I only keep like the prisma, the rates, and the primes. Everything else, like I just master and get rid of. Unless it's like something that took me a long time to grind. I've seen everyone here before. Hello, all. <laughs> Yeah, we're building a little bit of a community. I love when you guys come and drop by and say hi. You guys get to know each other, get friendly. That's the entire uh, that's the entire idea of this. Hopefully, I'm somewhat entertaining. Keep you guys laughing or somewhat impressed like because my Warframe hardly dies. <laughs> Uh, you know, I think it's gonna be crazy that the day that they release in Owl's Prime, I think that they they're gonna up the difficulty in this game by three times. Oh man, the, uh, that right yeah. there will probably be another one that I actually could just pay for to get it right away is in Aros Prime, because I fucking love in Aros. <laughs> yeah. The only other Prime that I think I'm actually going to shell out the money for is probably going to be Equinox Prime, just because I uh, Equinox is my other favorite. I love Equinox. <coughs> oh my god. Nox. Can I, suck? Can I actually get it? Devour him? How many Anaros? We actually have three Anaros in this right now. <laughs> I'm hey, using an Anaros, my brother's using Anaros, and uh, Guap is using Anaros. With a Nox, you see that? Look at that Nox. <laughs> ah, no. How long do they last? There's no timer on it. It's, you know, I don't know, though, we last till the next wave. This does seem to be kind of a long wave, though. Foster Boy, Dude, we're coming. Down. I got him. You should have known not to break Banshee in here. Yeah, he may not the have known that was nerfed. Bench. I didn't know Banshee was nerfed. Yeah, like the, re the resonating Quake still works pretty well, but it's not, you can't hold it. I hate that they did that because that was what, what made her useful. Yeah, but I feel like it would take away a lot of the gameplay because she's, she's so powerful and covers so much room, you know, with that range. That's the entire that, idea like, of building a Warframe like that, you know, it's... Right, but who knows, like, maybe other people just felt like they couldn't even get a kill because this thing would just go in there and just so hold don't, it to like, If, if they're straight. in there and you don't like that, don't be in there, you know, if you want to be the, the kill sponge. Right. I've had people rage quit when I use my uh, mm -hmm. Equinox because it's such a kill sponge. It just, just anything that, that comes within a thousand meters of it dies. <laughs> but there's some apps where you the defense where you will use it and it will kill the enemy be, like, as soon as they spawn but the, you wouldn't be able to get any loot. <clears throat> it will go up the it'll loot stays in the spawn point or it wouldn't even pop up on the map. So. Yeah. I can understand that <laughs> being a little frustrating but... That and another Nox. No. Oh, die. <clears throat> I wish I could summon a Nox. Oh, come here. Corrupted Nox. Oh. It looks so cool. It's so sexy. You're one of the only people I've ever heard say that the Nox looks cool. Ooh. 
you are my creation. Oh my god, yo. I'm so fast right now. I am oh, freaking funny. loving the, uh, the earning <laughs> the focus points. Extraction is ready. Unless you can handle more. I don't earn anywhere near what I've seen people <laughs> online earn, but uh <clears throat> Woohoo! Oh no. Oh! Great! Oh, wait, I'm, you know I'm crafting the Venkas? I've got four of those. <laughs> I'll take the Silva uh, AD just thing again. Alright, we'll extract this time. Don't go chase the booty car. My cleavers are maxed out, and my twin vipers as well. <clears throat> Yo, Naruto's is like the warframe to use Jaro on taught me how any great sorting. That is. Oh, hold on. Got a. Thank you on something. I'm trying to stream here. <laughs> Well, my build for Nautilus is pretty, uh, pretty glad though, let me see. <clears throat> I have Gladiator Resolve, which gives me 180% health, Transient Fortitude, 45% armor on Gladius A Gladiator Aegis, Steel Fiber, which is an additional 110% armor. Okay. Vitality, almost maxed out, missing one, so that's 400 plus health. Well, uh, I have vigor yeah. and armor agility. Just if you guys want to see my uh, Inaros build, I've got it up here on uh, screen right now. Uh, that is another arcane grace behind my picture, <laughs> just so you guys know. <laughs> you have so, they have a config B. Anyone who's interested, out? there's my Inaros build. I, I really, really like it. I think that it uh, that he you know he, he's plenty powerful and stays alive very well. Do you have a second build uh, for the second config, or no? Uh, I don't think I've got uh, the uh, config V or config C uh, uh, up for Inaros yet. You wanna try? You wanna try my build? I could throw it at you right now, just to put it in there. Uh, yeah, I'll uh, I'll probably throw it in uh, off camera because whenever the PlayStation sucks for that because yeah, you have to go to the blue screen of death, and I don't like. Oh, you don't have to. If you yeah, have but yeah, uh, if you take a picture of it and send it to me, I'd appreciate it. I'll check it out. <clears throat> No, what I was mean, like, if you go to config B, just put the mods that I have, I have, like, I can tell you to put them in there. Alright, what do we got here? <clears throat> well, you go to config B. Yep. You already have the corrosive projection, so that's good. In. No, but not, yeah, no, there you go. No, got the corrosive projection. I have steel fiber and vitality in there. Uh, I know I've got those here somewhere, because I've got them in my other one. Yeah. You should have enough points because you have way more points than I do. And you have the auto. <laughs> so I don't have unlocked yet the auxilious part. So you have more points. Yeah, so I think we have still fiber and vitality in there. Alright, there's still have... fiber finally. <laughs> and vitality is V, which is even further. You guys so are you asking have me Gladiator you... Aegis? Gladiator, it's what? A Aegis? Uh, I think it's called Aegis. It's um one of the mods you get from um, Cetus, the one with those swords. Uh, yes, I do. All right, so I put that one in there. Okay. With Gladiator Resolve, which gives you 180% health. I do not have Remember, Gladiator Resolve. So if I have an extra one, I'll give you one. Okay. Alright, so let me, obviously when you put those, like, they stack. So, <clears throat> I have Transient Fortitude, Vigor, and Armored Agility. Do I have Transient Fortitude? I don't even know about that. <laughs> I just made them, like, a tank, as tanky as possible. I do not have Transient Fortitude either. There's several of those I've been trying to get, but they're, they're a pain in the butt to get. Uh... 
42, wait, never mind, 42 is different. So we have Vigor, Armored Agility. Armored Agility I've got. Throw that in. And Vigor, I know I've got that as well. If you don't have uh, Transient Fortitude, you know, what also helps is health conversion. I don't know if you have that, but also a st every time you pick up a health orb, you stack on armor. <laughs> Let me take a look, because I don't know if I've got that either. Yeah. Uh, I do not have health conversion. <laughs> yeah. I got. I might have some of these mods I can hook you up with. I usually get them from that, um, from that place, uh, Cetus. I just need Maybe to, Rage? You need to hang out more, more in Cetus. Oh, wait, not Rage. Yeah. No, not Rage. It doesn't help. I also have an extra one for shields, but obviously now it doesn't need shields. Alright, so what, what else do you guys want to do? Uh, I mean, I'm cool with I'm whatever. Let's see. I, I knew I overlooked Inaros at first, but damn, yeah, Inaros rocks uh, just Warframe. <laughs> By the way, do you play on the uh, PlayStation or do you uh, do computer for Warframe? Assuming you're still watching. <laughs> I'm gonna switch my weapon up. Ooh, we got a survival of it now. Ah, you're on PC? That's unfortunate. I wish that uh, this game was uh, cross platform. It's not. If it was, I'd be like, hey man, come on, we'll invite you in. <laughs> It's cool, because you can do that on, like, Final Fantasy. It's like more, I remember the <clears throat> 11 was all, all cross-platform. Whoa. Yeah, it's uh, War Thunder's cross-platform, but the PC users have Ooh. an advantage over uh, over the PlayStation users, unfortunately. That would yeah. be awesome. Oh, yeah, man, it'd be good to get you in here. Hey, at least you did get to see the Anaros build that I've got, though, so if you do want to check it out, you know. <laughs> do, do, do. I wish it, they had a system where you can just gift a mod in your inventory instead of trading, you know? <clears throat> yeah, they don't really have a, a gift system. Well, I mean, they have a gift system, but you have to go and purchase it from the <laughs> thing, and you can't purchase individual mods. I All screenshot right. it. <clears throat> All right. <laughs> oh, I do have an extra Open Hell Shout, if you, do, if you do get an Inaros, it is well worth... Uh, Inaros is well worth the effort to build up <laughs> and to build properly. I, I, I absolutely love him. Uh, Nidus is another one that's that's really strong. I just don't like Nidus's powers, uh, the way you have to use him. Ooh, that clap. I have an extra one for you, man. <clears throat> you are lucky. <clears throat> Transient Fortitude, though, I think the only way to get those is doing Nightmare Missions. Yeah. the I thought Transient Fortitude is one that you got from... Um, the the vaults yeah or maybe yeah I th i'm pretty sure that's one you get from the vaults all right guys give me just one second here i need to run and use the restroom and i'll be right back <laughs> Take out the transit of fortitude and put something else. <clears throat> yeah. 
Yeah, guys, this is real life. Stuff happens. <laughs> <clears throat> By the way, um, I want to mention, you don't really need the transient fortitude, but it does give you more, uh, more sh uh, ability strength oh, and it decreases duration. And the reason I have it there, I remember it's because when you actually devour an enemy, you get way more health. Ah, yeah. okay. But intensified probably works perfect too. So. Yeah. I just, uh, mm. I've gotten to where I don't really use, um, like I said, I don't really use Inaris' powers too much <laughs> until I get into really, really bad areas. If I go into a, to a high level area, I will charge up that extra, uh, the Scarab Shield and really get things going. But it's, it's yeah. pretty rare that I, that I have a need I keep for that. that. The, the armor, uh, I keep that, not the Intensify, but I have the armor of uh, Transient Fortitude there. You want to go do a, uh, I don't know, uh, select a mission somewhere, man. Let's 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 go do something fun. Let's go. Uh, no, no, no. Let's see. We have a survival. It's freaking out, Warframe. Ah, absolutely, Warframe. We appreciate having you here, as well as everyone else who's lurking around and not saying anything. You guys are also very much appreciated. <laughs> <laughs> I bought some maxi uh, interceptions. Are you down for that? Uh, not crazy about interceptions. I'll do it, but uh, you know, the only um, the only with the inarrows, we'll be able to hold it down each. So sure. yeah, no, we can we can do an interception if you want. That's fine with me. It's an axi, so it might be Shut go up, down space faster. mom. Quit telling me about things I don't care about. Space mom. So that's essentially what the Lotus is to the Tenno. <laughs> She's space mom. <laughs> All right, bring, we bring out the goodies. All right, we're good. <laughs> Dragalora MH06. Nice. Why not? Let's let him know that he's being streamed. Streaming live on Twitch. Say hi. Some people are friendly about it, some people are assholes about it, so. I picked one. Sorry, Wolf, you get next. <laughs> That's what uh, Detroit Dub says. He picked, a, All right. picked the mission Biological for us. Attacks. Be ready. I just saw a mission available, so huh, whatever. Yes to everything right now. Oh, there we go, and there we go, and yeah. Oh, 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 no, damn it, I actually want the sword out, there we go. It's the guap. That seemed like a really short wave. Am I the only one who thinks that? <laughs> we either really killed it or that wave was ridiculously short. Guap is back. You see how short that uh, that wave was, man? I mean, I could always bring my Nova. It's gonna get a lot shorter with Guap here. <laughs> Check up on my daughter. Hey, uh, Dubs, is this for, uh, 
Is this for something? I see it's counting down instead of counting up. <laughs> Just one of the alerts. You want the Wukong helmet? <laughs> I remember I've been playing this game for about six months uh, and tried to do missions like this. Obviously, it wasn't for Wu Kang, but uh, it was things like this. And it was like, holy crap! Yeah, it's alert. It's like this stuff's not really an issue anymore, but for a while there, stuff like this was pretty freaking hard. <clears throat> Don't go That's literally the only part of that song that I know, otherwise I would have joined in. You have it your way, you're not there. <laughs> she don't says, love, uh, Nikki says, love, uh, Nikki says, lovely singing. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, gotta love the singing. So, I was thinking, some point in the future, I'm, uh, I wanna do, like, an intro video, and it's gonna be, uh, me beatboxing. That was a close uh, one. Oh, yeah, I'm you were doing that the other day. Uh, you had, uh, pretty yeah. good skills with that. I, I can't do that to save my life. But, uh... Yeah. Like uh, Eminem, also uh, he he's uh, another one of the uh, people who sings. He's got a YouTube channel where uh, where he does that. Um, puts out yeah, uh, like, EPs so and stuff. I, I, I keep like trying a, to like a nineties beatbox, you know, like a cool <laughs> classic intro to my to my uh, channel. You know? It would be awesome. Still, Beastie Boys kind of. What mission? What what mission? Get it, get it. Don't stop. <laughs> well, something like something like that. You know? I gotta just kind of sit down and work. Right? And my throat doesn't kill me. I top of that. Oh, I, I hear you there. Yeah. I've been uh, been right trying now. to convince uh, Eminem to do a uh, since he does the cover songs and stuff. I really been trying to convince him to do that uh, Celine Dion song of that and I. <laughs> he can, he like can, get, he can get further up there, you know. It's like, oh, come on, man, do it, do it, do it. I ever thought somebody like hosts you or follows you, like just throw that one in there. <laughs> It'll get yeah. you with people to follow you instantly, man, right? because they won't love you. to hear it. Thank you so much for all for following me. And I who will we'll always, always love you. you. <laughs> <laughs> I apologize for breaking everyone's ears for singing. <laughs> I love learning to beatbox once. It's, oh, I tried learning to beatbox once. I've uh, I've watched some videos on it, but uh, I, I just I don't have the I don't have the skills to keep the the rhythm or whatever. Uh, it's practice. I mean, I'm not I'm not the best, you know. But I used to beatboxing when I was younger and. In school, I used to like freestyle and things like that. Even in the shower, man. <laughs> Me and uh, Detroit Dubs here, our older brother uh, <laughs> does a lot of the beatboxing and, and the singing. He actually uh, produced, uh, well, he found some tracks and downloaded them off the internet, and then he uh, he sung over them. But they were they were both extremely impressive uh, with this exactly. rap personality he was developing. Uh, called himself the Nasty Butcher. Oh. I mean, uh, it, it was it, it was both very good songs. I still got them uh, on my computer. Been trying to convince nice. him to try to do another one, and just you know, with wife and kids, he, he's just busy. Yeah, I've always like freestyled since I was young, but you know, it's like a different generation, so it doesn't really appeal to anybody. I didn't. I just do it as a hobby. I'm, I'm just like a spitting like. Spinning image of the 90s kid, you know, like that's all I am. <laughs> Everything 90s and 80s as well, but let's go. 
Yeah, I, I used to get the I baggy pants, you know, three, colorful. So. I had like I these shoes, man. right? They're like Thundercats. I don't know if you ever heard of Thundercats. Oh, fuck yeah, Thundercats. I grew Ta up watching yeah. Thundercats. I should, I should love my shoes. That's some Thundercat shoes. And... Although, uh, I have to admit that one episode I saw of um, <laughs> Robot Chicken, where it, it was like the Thundercats, you know, now what are they doing now? And it showed Lionel uh, as a weather reporter. And he's pointing with uh, with a sword at the weather, and he's thunder, thunder, thunder. I laughed my ass off. <laughs> that shit is crazy. I love I love Robot Chicken, man. That was a good time. The my other uh, favorite episode of Robot Chicken has got to be the one where uh, it's got they're making fun of uh, Snuggles the bear and that um, you know the that downy? fabric softener thing. Yeah, the, the downy. Yeah, yeah, yeah and, and downy. he keeps uh, <laughs> he keeps bringing the bear into another room and, and just you know, you know, molesting the crap out of it, and uh, he's oh like, "Oh, but God. you're you're just so soft," and it's like, "I'm not that soft." <laughs> oh, my it's it's God. so wrong, but I, I just I can't help but to laugh at it because it, it's so ridiculous. What's the name of that 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 actor though? He's he's the head of that, right? Oh, uh, Seth Green, I think. Seth, yeah, Seth Green. He, I didn't, I didn't know until like years later that he was uh, behind all that. Yeah, I was like, no. Uh, Scott, he's like Dr. a kid, dude. Uh, yeah. Doctor Evil, Austin Powers. Yeah, <laughs> he's that kid, you know. He's like a '90s kid, so I heart. So he, he had all those like great ideas, action figures and stuff, you know, like as a collector and make. My friends and I used to do that before we even found out about that. We used to like do videos with like action figures and make fun, you know. Yeah. Back in middle school. Lovely singing, dope. Holy hell, that's <laughs> awesome! I'm trying to learn beatbox once. <laughs> uh, you guys, uh, you guys are what makes this kind of stuff uh, worth doing. Is to come in, hang out with you guys, and see, you know, see what you guys have, what you guys think, what you guys are up to. It would not be worth doing this if, if there was nobody here to to enjoy the game with and everything. But I, I come from a little bit of an older older generation where this was used to be how you, how you played games because there wasn't uh, there wasn't online games. You know, you, you went over to your buddy's house, you sat down and you you watched your friends play games. You know, and you, and you sat there and would would joke around with them and play around, have a good time. I miss that. You know, it's uh, most of my friends. We've, we've all grown up. We've we've moved away. A lot of the the my closest friends live out in Illinois, where I was for uh, several years before moving back to Michigan. <laughs> Makes it hard to try to get together as everybody gets older and has you know life happen to them. Ooh, cleaving winds. I know somebody that might need it. That is another reason why I love streaming so much, though, is because it, it gives you that chance to uh, close the gap. And being able to sit here and, and, you know, talk with you guys as it pops up and everything, it, 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 it's, it's awesome. I, I love it. Does Cleaving win better than Go Charge? <clears throat> cleaving win. I think that's a, uh, that's a stance, isn't it? Stance. Right? Okay, so yeah, never mind. Never mind. I got that confused. That's for the melee mods and the aura mods. Got it. Mobby. <clears throat> Wolf killing everything. <laughs> yeah, Wolf somehow yeah. got ten more kills than me. I'm trying to keep up. Oh, I was I was away. I had to like step away and check on my not on my daughter. You know. <clears throat> I'm surprised I got that many kills. <clears throat> Guap Nation. Tuning in to the Guap Guap Nation. <laughs> get, get it. Tuning in and get it. Tuning in. Fly stream. Oh my lord. Kicharo. On the word frame tip. Get, get it. Yeah. <laughs> That's it because I'm not, I can't do the high pitch stuff right now.
<laughs> I can do a BJ and a scratch and you know I can do it all. <clears throat> well, that, that's certainly <clears throat> impressive. All right, it's uh, your turn to pick something there, Guap. Me, I'm down for whatever. <laughs> And uh, Nikki uh, is saying, uh, "Yeah, uh, break it down." <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's probably one thing I'll try to throw in my streams at some point. I'm gonna throw some beatbox, and people know that I can do it. You know. If your mother only that you was trying to get it's the... with me. The people who can do it while they while they sing at the same time just are, are so <laughs> impressive. Uh, like the one guy I saw doing it where he where he was uh, slamming into it, and it's just like, oh god, that, that you know, just the, the talent. I am so blown away by the talent of so many different people. <laughs> like uh, <laughs> even Nikki Lots here on her, uh, I went to check out her YouTube channel. She's got some uh, some awesome videos on there. But some of her earliest videos is her doing uh, the uh, American Sign Language, but she's doing it uh, to two songs so that you know the the, the deaf can uh, read the lyrics. I guess I'm not sure how you would you would word that, <laughs> but I mean even even just keeping up up with what's going on you know on the on the screen is it's like man that that right there is that, that's talent I just I don't got you know. Practice. I, I love all these talented perfect. people that, that that like to hang around. Mm -hmm. It's it's impressive to me. Like Guap, like Guap, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Guap self selflessly uh, self promoting. Guap <laughs> Nation. Guap Nation, Guap Guap Nation. Yeah, I still gotta work on that though. But I, I just hit me one time. I was in the shower and I even told my girlfriend, I was like, I was, it just hit me. Like, <laughs> Guap it all Nation happens in follower, the shower. get the hell out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. ASL syntax is like uh, Yoda speech. So you gotta know how to switch it around so it makes sense to deaf people. That, <laughs> thanks for the compliment. Yeah, it's uh, never never could quite do the the Yoda speak all, all that well. I can do a pretty decent imitation of like Smeagol <laughs> from Lord of the Rings. <laughs> Great talent you have. Scratch. DJ. <laughs> the Force is strong within you. <laughs> Where are so, we going, Mr. Bringing my Black? ember, though. Just so you know. Bringing my ember. You can bring whoever you want. Bringing my ember, ember, December, lender. Oh! Yeah. Survival? Um, I know that uh, Nikki does not currently have a um, computer, you guys, so she's not able to uh, update her YouTube. But if you guys would, please, uh, I'm just dropping the link in the chat right now. Go there, take a look uh, at some of her videos, and uh, go ahead and leave her a, a subscription. It's on YouTube, so subscription's the right, the right term there. <laughs> so, Switching back yeah. and forth between YouTube and Twitch, you know, you tell somebody, "Hey, you know, thanks for subscribing." They're like, "I didn't subscribe." It's like, yeah, "I meant follow." It's, it's, to me, it's the they're one and the same. But uh, here on here on Twitch, subscribing means that you're you're paying money. So I mean, I, I get there's a difference, but yeah, subscription requires money. So yeah, go give uh, go give my girl Nikki a hookup, you guys, if you will. Uh, just make sure to follow her page and check out some of her videos. Leave her some nice comments. You what, Nikki? What you at? Let me see, Nikki. Oh, uh, follow this, Nikki. Hey, one thing you need to learn about uh, my channel is, is if you come into my channel and you're a streamer, it is hashtag show the support. <laughs> we throw support everywhere we can. <clears throat> Ain't that right, Guap? So, that's right. That's right. And you also got to show support for Savage Patch. <laughs> Wherever she may be. <laughs> I'm not sure where, uh, where Savage is. She sent me a, a, a picture of the, the new thing that she's done for her channel. 
uh, some like I guess it looks kind of like a business card that, that she's got going on. It uh, <laughs> Lex just sent me a message telling me that I was mean because <laughs> I told her since she had to go to work, I'm just going to be lazing around the here sitting uh, sitting at home relaxing. <laughs> oh, Nikki uh, just sent me a follow. I'm about to follow back. Let me see. Yeah, she uh, found a picture of a whole bunch of uh, cabbages and put herself behind several uh, several of them. And then underneath, uh, on the top, it says, Welcome to the Savage Patch. And I love that she oh, went with that because we, we, joked, we joked about that with her. That's, yeah, that's we're framed. He, see, he gets it. Show the support. <laughs> yeah. Got, got to, uh, you got to. I mean, I respect that so much from you guys and the community that we're, that we're, that we're building here. It is so much more. I mean, I, I love that you guys come to watch me, but it's so much more than, than me. I mean, the, there's so many talented streamers out there. All of us are, are small streamers. I personally really like the variety streamers, uh, the ones who who play a multitude of different games. It just it, it means so much to me when you guys showing showing up and and giving love and just liking to hang out and laugh. Yeah. By the way, uh, Courtney mentioned that she was down to jump on that. Um, Hawking. I told her I was I was gonna wait for a little bit until we uh until we got together and like run it. Well, Show the support. <laughs> Time catches all of us, overshadowing everything. Hey, absolutely, Dubsy. Uh, that's actually <laughs> that was uh, something I said a long, long time ago. Um, but I heard it on a uh, Insane Clown Posse song. <laughs> Yeah, show the support. Way. Yeah, look at that. Hashtag show the support everywhere, anywhere. Uh... Ember with the flame. Flame it. Hey, somebody has to rub it into Lex that she has to go to work. So Lex, get your ass to work. Oh! <laughs> I'm not doing it out of spite. I'm doing it because I consider her a friend. <laughs> If I'm if I'm poking around with you and everything, it means that I like you. It's a good thing. Look at Guap. He's so Guap right now. Yo, we gotta jump on that Harkin though. We gotta set up a squad. Does your brother have it? Yeah. Uh, I don't think that Justin has it. Um, I, like I said, I, I downloaded it the other day because you mentioned it to me, and it, it was it sounded like something cool. I've always been a huge fan of um, like, like I was saying, Armored stuff. Core. And, uh, yeah, it's very similar. It's fun. Armored Core was, was you... just absolutely amazing. I've not oh, seen a new Armored Core in a long time, though. I think it's a game that you enjoy more playing amongst friends than. Despite yeah, true yourself. friends do that. Absolutely, <laughs> Nikki. You get it. <laughs> uh, yes, uh, Hawking is, is free. free dubs. It's uh, available Download on the PlayStation. It and we'll set up a squad. You should definitely get in there and play it with us. It'd be a lot of fun. I think you said it's a, it's a four-person squad? Uh, yeah. Sweet. I, I don't know if there's more to the team. I don't remember. It, yeah, can, it might be more people. But remember, it's, like, it, it's pretty intense. It is, it is Hawken, although whenever uh, Guap was telling me about it, he was calling it Kraken. So I had a fun time yeah. trying to find it at first. <laughs> 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 Oh yeah, I don't know what's going on. Hey, you need, to, you need to download and check out Kraken. It's like, oh, that's that's awesome. It's kind of like boat game or something. Nah, hey, man, you get these giant there. mechs. It's, it's Kraken. Oh, you must have missed it. <laughs> not, maybe you must have missed it. You can't buy it anymore. It's only limited. Yeah, this is, this is a limited uh, three-hour download. You you missed it in that window time. You don't get it ever. Yeah. <laughs> There's actually I, a horror like game that, that uh, is no longer available, uh, but I, I so wish I could get a hold of a copy of it. Um, the because all it was was a demo, but it's called um, Silent Hill one. Oh yeah, the Silent Hill one. Uh, I forget what it's called. Oh, but my God, I watched I watched somebody play that. Yeah, it was like, oh, um, I want I want it so bad. I want it. <laughs> um, it's called the playable demo, or whatever, but. Yeah, uh, yeah, PT, RT, PT, yes. playable teaser. PT. I, I want go. that so damn bad, and it, it it is it's just not available. And it's like, oh come on. <laughs> I have it, but 
I would I would pay for that demo. I mean, s seriously. If if yeah, they would just release that demo that for like fifteen that. bucks, I would buy that today. I got so scared. I remember the first time I played it. I re I went around the corner <laughs> and I saw this woman like shaking and, and like and and she's like standing in the dark. I was like, oh my god, I don't want to move forward. And she starts doing these weird noises like the ring. Yeah, oh, I, I I totally want to play that. Like, Dub ah, says, release the kraken. <laughs> now you got to get that. To do the the grudge, you gotta get that uh, you know kind of uh, tone to it. She kind of she does more like a. Uh, <laughs> yeah, but she's got you know she gets that 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 uh, crick in her uh, in her voice, so it's uh, making that uh, almost like reverse chirp noise. <laughs> Thank you. Sounds like she's being choked. I thought it was very creative though, like the demo itself. Like there's that one room when you hear like a baby crying and then you went to the living room and there's like a, a fridge yeah, hanging, hanging from, from the room. room. Man, and I'll tell you, I, after I watched from... that, I, I immediately went and looked for it. It was already off the PlayStation. Like I, I, I hadn't seen the game when it first came out, unfortunately. But it, it, it's, yeah. my God, I, I would seriously, if, if they did nothing besides just put that demo back up, I would buy it right now. <laughs> yeah. It's fun, um, but after for like one or two playthroughs, you're like, eh. Yeah, but, yeah, for, for but it's, like, it's like I want, I want to experience it firsthand. You know, I mean, it's one thing to watch it; it's another thing to be to actually get to play it. Yeah. Most horror games are not replayable. You know, it's uh, like I, I played Soma on my YouTube channel, and although the audio sucked in, in one or two positions because of uh, technical difficulties, unfortunately. Um, I, I did play the entire playthrough of Soma, and I, I, I'm a horror buff, a horror movie buff. I love horror movies, but it's like that stuff. It, it didn't even jump scare me at all. Most of the time, I was laughing at the at the enemy. They were a con inconvenience. They weren't really scary. <laughs> Very few people do a great job at scary. I mean, I, I don't get scared easily, but I'll like well, I'll appreciate. I don't, don't want to be like, fake either on my channel. You know, that's, that's one thing that. Uh, when, when you see me, I, I'm trying to make sure you guys see the real me, so I'm not going to sit there and, and act like, Oh, that scared the crap out of me. Yeah, well, no, heard, it, heard, if something uh, scares me, you know, it, it's, it, it's going to be a legitimate scare, you know? When I first streamed um, Resident Evil, Biohazard, oh my god. I was actually kind of like jumpy. I haven't played a Resident Evil in a long time. That, that's another fun game to play. You play the Biohazard? Uh, like I said, I, I've not played a Resident Evil in a long time. I think the last one I played was uh, four. You play Biohazard, man. That was pretty intense. Like there's a scene when like you literally shoot people in the face and like stab them in the neck and they get back up. Like it, it, like they weren't phased by it. I'm like, what the fuck is going on here? <laughs> so, <laughs> and you use a chainsaw and they come back at you. You run out of ammo. You don't know what to do. Like. You <laughs> I had some moments, man. I haven't beat I, the game yet, but pretty intense. if you haven't played Biohazard, I uh, definitely recommend it. Uh, I will add that to my yeah. list of games to check out. That seems to be ever growing. <laughs> I might, I might stream it too. So, like, uh, at some point, you'll probably jump on the stream. I, it's in the list of things I must throw out. I have yeah, to beat. Yeah, absolutely. I, I've so. uh, barely seen you stream since uh, since I've shown up here. I've tried to catch whenever you do go live. Yeah, I will now since I'm getting my pro. I just kind of been busy with stuff, you know. And uh, on top of that, I kind of feel like the my PlayStation makes too much noise in the background. Like I said, and... whenever I was watching, I, I didn't hear that. And even now, I don't hear it uh, whirring around. Uh, when I wa when I watch my videos, like I hear it in the back. It sounds like a like a fan, you know. Huh. I didn't, I didn't, Maybe I you just have better hearing that. than I do. That's, that's possible. Yeah. <laughs> that was me because it gets really loud, like like it's overheating. So when I watch the vid, <laughs> when I when I take when I look at my clips, you know, from Twitch, I it's disturbing. You know, like I don't want that to like make people want to like leave the stream because Get it's annoying. You know? Right. I think so most people, when they come to a stream like that, and then they're regular visitors, I think they're there more for the personality than they are necessarily uh, sound difficulties or 
anything else. They're yeah. they're there because they they enjoy watching and spending time uh, with you. You know. I At least that's my hope. That's the reason views. why I go to streams. <laughs> yeah. I do. I do get the decent viewers, but to me, like, it matters to me. Oh like, yeah, you, you definitely want to want to do the the best that you can do. Obviously, you know, and, and that's one thing I I, I want to keep trying to improve and, and and get better as well. Yeah. I'm definitely gonna set up my OBS at some point. Have the capture card. I build a new PC. So little by little, you know, I will. I'll get there. You know. yeah. Once I'm I can get a computer that I can put a capture card in, um, my intention with that is then I, I would like to also be able to play some of the old uh, PlayStation 3 games because I have a hundred or more PlayStation 3 games that that I, that I love, but they're not they're not backwards compatible on the four. Mm. So with a capture card, uh, I could I actually do that, but like console. like here I can't. <laughs> Oh, you, if you have the PS Now, you can play them, right? They should be. Um, uh, yeah, but you can't. Uh, you can't do PS Now to play them and uh, stream at the same the time. Fight, the oh, so you can't stream the PS3 titles? Not whenever you're doing PS PS3. Now, no. Oh, that what a bummer. Yeah, okay, so uh, that, but I mean, it sort of makes sense because it's using your internet connection to play the game. You don't actually download the game. It's just streaming the game. I yeah. So I mean, I, I sort of get it, but but then what if somebody wants to stream an old title like that? That would be so like you'd have to. Well, you could do it actually if you use the OBS system, right? Yeah, that's what I mean. If, if you use the the capture card and an OBS, then then you can do it that way. But uh, that's that's about the only way you can you can do it, or wait for them to make a, a remake of a certain game. And thankfully, they do there. seem to be remaking some of the games that I actually like. And yes, we know, Guap, you want Spyro. <laughs> you read my mind. I was like, let me just throw it out there and let me make it through. <laughs> Spyro. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I love Spyro. Though. I only played the first one, dude, and it's like one of those memorable games. And I wouldn't buy them uh, unless it didn't look good. And let me tell you, it looks so crispy. Like, I love it. Hmm. And chat Especially that game, I'm gonna Monday stream on Monday. Uh, Staying still. <laughs> Get that Swords of Ditto. Oh I still God, see so seven of you guys hanging out, so I appreciate you. Feel free to drop a line in chat. We'll we will involve you guys. Get you talking. Answer any questions you got. That kind of thing. Incoming. I've Yo, never I'm done one of those, uh, you know, like Q and A type things. That might be interesting. Yeah, at some point. I don't know if we can still do it from consoles, but like a split stream will be awesome, dude. Like if we ever got together and did something like that, that'd be so fun. We appreciate you. Aw, thanks, Nikki. I certainly uh, certainly appreciate you dropping by and, and hanging out today. I've All the ways you guys could be spending time and you choose to be here with me, that that, that truly means, means the world to me. Aww. Thank you guys, thank you guys for showing my friends some support. Attack us and we will counter. Oh. The other day, um, I know that we're not on the, the same platform, but when I streamed, uh, I had ten people watching my uh, watching my stream, and after I got done, I found out that Markiplier on YouTube was streaming at the exact same time, and I was like, oh man, people chose to watch me over Markiplier. I, I appreciate the fuck out of that. <laughs> Yeah, he streams. A, I haven't seen his stream live yet, but uh, he, uh, he was doing a, uh, a welcome to the game two or something. Uh, I don't watch a whole lot of Mark. Uh, Jack That's said the guy is much more my speed. I, I like, like Jack. I really feel like is is uh, somebody who I think I could hang out with in real life. Not that he you know necessarily would want to hang out with me, but I, I, he seems like that kind of guy. And Mark, I think, yeah. would just get on my nerves. Like, he, he seems like a cool guy, but I'm pretty sure he'd get on my nerves. <laughs> well, then again, some people who stream, remember, that might not be their true uh, character, you know? Like, they kind of go a little bit over and above yeah, and beyond. Yeah, yeah. That, that's you know, another so reason why I, I try so hard not to do that. I, I, want, I want to be who I actually am. I don't want people to get... Uh, to get a, uh, an idea in their head or to uh, sit there and try to make me into something I'm not. 
You know, it's, hi, I'm Dave. Feel free to walk up and say hi to me on the street, you know? <laughs> I'm not, I'm not. <laughs> I, get, I get a little hype though sometimes, you know? I, I get pumped. Mm. Yeah, super hype. Like, it honestly, it, it'd probably freak me out if somebody did walk up to me on the street like, "Oh, hey, you're Kajaro, you're my favorite streamer." I'd be, I, you know, that that would be be so weird for that to happen. It would be awesome, but weird. <laughs> I almost got one shot at my poor Ender. Do you need health? No, I'm good. Well, I might need health. But... Well, here. Uh, you're standing by me? Yeah. There's a health thing. Thank you, sir. Yeah, you're welcome. They, all, they just one shot at me with that stump. Almost one shot. Haha, <laughs> right? Wolfman Guap is now hosting you. Thank you for the host, Guap. Guap? I, I should have done it earlier. I forgot. I was so caught up with the game. <laughs> It is all yeah, good, no. my friend. I, I certainly appreciate the host. Look what our have just found. Still fiber. Yes. I've got uh, quite a few people from uh, our group on the um, on Level Up Basement, and uh, quite a few people that uh, I'm friends with otherwise uh, set up to auto uh, auto host. So if I'm not uh, playing, that it, it'll automatically pick one of them and throw them in there. Look at this. That's another way that I that I like to show the support is, you know, even if I'm not able to be there physically, if I if I can still you know send traffic your way, yeah, I want I want to do that for you guys. Auto home. But then when you actually join the stream and you want to host them, you're like, wait a second, I'm already auto hosting them, so I have to unhost them and host them again so they can get that cool little notification. <laughs> <laughs> that's just me. <laughs> We're a savage patch. We need him. I don't know. Somebody should uh, text her and be like, what the hell? Now, I hope, uh, hope I was able to uh, drive some people there to check out your channel as well, Nikki. Hosting is the new thing I, since I I've said, been on Twitch last. Uh, what's the end goal with that? I think it's just uh, it's a way for you to be able to show support to your friends and stuff uh, and to be able to get them to, to get some extra subscribers. It's, it's a way to showcase someone else's channel that, that you appreciate. I think it's just a community thing. I don't think, I don't think that there's an actual, like... Uh, in goal necessarily um, in, in that I way. really think I mean I think you can do like custom match just in random with a uh, Hawking so like it could be games like that or like uh, Brawlhalla you can use the people on the stream to download the game because it's free and it's probably not that big <laughs> so interacting with like your viewers is awesome really fun. getting just jumping in and maybe they don't know about about these games and all of a sudden you know they're like I'd be thankful because yeah, it's, we'll, I've we'll had be several mocked. people tell me that they they they've not really heard anything about Warframe before seeing my stream on it, and it's like, well, hey, happy to be able to throw some th throw some attention to a game that I I've enjoyed playing for so long. Yeah. That's what I meant. You just worded it weird. <laughs> I I know well, that, that I'm, I'm a little weird, sort of Nikki. Bitter. So <laughs> there's no such thing as being weird. Everyone's normal in their own way, except for the weirdos. Being normal is overrated. Uh, one of Nikki's last videos before she uh, lost the laptop, she had some weirdo uh, talking about like a foot fetish on there, you know, asking her about her feet uh, and everything. And it's like, <laughs> there are some weirdos out there, you know. It's. I mean, they could pay pretty well. Um... <laughs> If anybody wanted to get a foot fetish with me, if you're not weird, you're weird. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> this whole concept of normal is overrated. Yeah, yeah. come get my footsie. Uh, <laughs> I'm a dork. You guys either will like me or you won't. That's, that's entirely up to you. It's not going to change who I am. I can be a dork and squat nation. <laughs> I said, ooh, boo, boo. 
You seen that girl tries to sing that song? She has like glasses and she's so offbeat. I mean, I have uh, cute feet, but not for random strangers' eyeballs. <laughs> she, she went viral, man. Like she was like seriously offbeat, but like it just went viral. Yeah. Like it's a little geeky girl with the glasses and like. <laughs> it's like what? Yeah, uh, I agree with you. <laughs> 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 there are a lot of people with some with some very strange uh, proclivities, but yeah. ah. I mean, people do anything to get famous. Yeah, there are there are some people out there that are try hard to be celebrities, but they don't know that we are all celebrities in the inside. <laughs> to me, it's like uh, <laughs> that, what, what was that? Uh, Rat Race. Have you guys seen that movie? Oh, that was years ago. Yeah, I, yeah. I know it was years ago, but uh, they they were oh, those rich guys were betting on everything, and that uh, they had their, their their one butler dude uh, called that uh, hooker, and he's he's like, uh, how much would it be for you to uh, shave my back, uh, you know, while we we sit in a hot tub full of um, uh, like uh, Pepto Bismol. <laughs> and uh, she, Random, she's she's yeah. like uh, for that kind of party, you're talking in the you know five hundred dollar range. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's like oh, man, yeah. uh, I can't imagine uh, what those poor girls get asked to do because you know you, you know that there are people out there with like weird weird ass shit like that, and it's like. But then where, again, where they even, have the choice to say no, something but like they say that. yes for the money. Yeah. Yeah. I know a couple girls. It was very a and long time ago. <laughs> Don't make me do the views. <laughs> long, long oh. timey, a long timey, man. Ah. Oh, I forgot you can get on top of that big gun. Oh, no shit. amount of money, none. <laughs> oh no, Guap is down. How is this picture oh, healing good. us? Guap has been healed. Thank you. I wasn't too far away from you. I was coming. Yeah. 21 minutes. The spores have almost completely saturated the My health is still full. <laughs> it ain't gonna drop. That's for sure. Nah, the, uh, we are starting to run out of life support pretty quickly, though. Yeah. I gotta kill faster. Well, part of it is I'm not able to pick it up because I switched uh, to my Kubro, so it's not just being drawn to me. Yeah, I don't, I don't have my I have my um I don't have my Kavat this time. Here we go. We're back up to 94%. We're good enough. <laughs> yeah, I agree with you, Nikki. Oh. There, there are some things that uh, that no matter what somebody's willing to pay, I'm not willing to do. <laughs> I don't know. I feel like anything could be bought off. I just gotta give you the right number. Yeah, that, that, I used to have a you boss who used to ask weird, weird ass fucking questions um, when I worked at um, uh, Comp USA. <laughs> And uh, one of, one of, I mean, he like he he really got off on asking weird ass questions like, uh, for like for ten million dollars, if Michael Jackson wanted to have sex with you, would you do it? It's like for no I'll amount of money yes. am I am I doing am I having sex with Michael Jackson? Fuck no. I'll say yes. I will say yes. <laughs> for ten million dollars, I don't care, man. Come on, man. No, that's that's <laughs> fuck yes. no. There's Yo. some things that that's, it's, it's not worth it, man. I wouldn't, well, nobody has to know, but it, I was like, it, No, like, no, dude, it would cost more than 10, 10 million dollars to fucking deal with, uh, with the fucking therapy bills. Nah, you fine. I just pretend like it never happened, you know? Just pretend, you gotta, oh yeah, you know, it, it never happened, therapy it never happened. happened. Like, he was never back there going, I walked away like, oh! <laughs> 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 on, like, I just walked away with 10 million dollars, yo. I did what I had to do. <laughs> 
one time deal. No, I'm no guap. I, I disagree with you there, sir. There, there's there's some things that is not <laughs> worth it. Money is not everything, know. man. It's. I mean, if it was like in the thousands, of course not. But if like you talk of ten million dollars, that's like. What do you want me to do? <laughs> <laughs> Wolf in his Ferrari. When suddenly Michael Jackson comes on the radio, he gets blurry vision from. <laughs> that's awesome, Dubs. <laughs> <laughs> oh man wolf just starts that crying and it's like oh no what did i do <laughs> ah man it's all it's all drama man oh no dude look that that's not drama all right that that's that's a hell no i mean what if i man what if it was a gay guy and he would have no problem would, doing that. Yeah, if it was a gay guy, a I'm not a gay guy. But at, at, you know, it's even that. It's, you gotta have some standards, man. It's like even if it was like a, a hot uh, Hollywood starlet, you know, uh, one one of them uh, women. It's like I ain't doing that shit either. You know what the hell they got? Hell with that. It ain't, it ain't worth that, man. Oh, man, ten million dollars. It's like, I'm like pretty that. sure for ten million dollars he can get someone a lot better than me. Oh, we got a juggernaut. Wow. You got that kind of you got that kind of money. You you ain't you ain't looking for you ain't looking for me. You looking man, for you see these pretty ass girls, man. <laughs> you see like beautiful women, right? With the ugliest guys, and they'll do the nastiest stuff. But you don't want their soul paid. They'll do it once or twice, and that's it. They're set for life. You know. But then, I, then again, that's funny. Where's Michael Jackson? Hee <laughs> hee! <laughs> my ten million dollars. <laughs> uh, guap. No, man. No. No, no. So good, guap. Just guap kidding. flying around in his own it. private helicopter like, it was worth it. <laughs> I'm just trying to make the conversation interesting, but I probably wouldn't do it either. <laughs> it's not tempting at all. At fucking all. The 10 million? Yeah, but the condition? Not so much. <laughs> I mean, I don't know. And then again, it's like, damn, is my booty hole like $10 million worth? I, I feel good about that. Like, damn. <laughs> 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 that's, 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 that's the way to <laughs> rationalize it, I guess. But, but still, that's, that's a fuck no on, on my. There's no. Man, you know those soccer players, man, they, they spend a lot of money, they have a, like, they spend millions of dollars on, like, insurance for their legs. I'm like, yo, oh, these, these guys have, like, you know? <laughs> Guap takes out a $10 million insurance policy on his ass. <laughs> There's nothing that can't be undone. <laughs> <laughs> In or out. <laughs> no. Oh man. Good left. Good left. Good guys. Yeah, and that is forever immortalized in a video. <laughs> Guap, where are you? I am down. Yeah, I see you're down, but. It... Your brother's where? picking me up. Well, mm -hmm. Somebody else is getting you good. They. They. Oh shit, all you guys headed this way. Alright, coming. Who was that one guy that one shot me? It's like he, he hits me with some corrosive stuff and hits my dad, my uh, house. That, uh, that mist gets to where it starts just tearing down, uh, tearing down your life no matter what you do. Mm. I do have corrosive damage on too, so the, the, the single lord kind of cuts into that. Well, then again, the closer one works on armor, so maybe I'm wrong. This guy's gonna have armor. That's one of the reasons I like the radiation damage. It, it cuts through a lot of stuff, too. There's, they should have a mod that reduces, like, instead of just corro like, corrosive mod, like corrosive mod, but like, an all mod that has, like, an elemental specific you know, like, Reduces, or gives you, like, additional, like, poison, like, corrosive or fire. Keep damage or radiation, whatever. 
It'll boost. I just wish they'd put more of the uh, the mods and stuff back into like general population to where. Like, I'm okay with it being hard to get or rare to get, but don't make it impossible to get, you know, where it's like, hey, the only way to get this is to do this one specific mode on this certain day of the year, you know. <laughs> it's like, I mean, man, there, sure there's so it's many mods enough. in this game I don't have because of how they've made them so hard to get. Yeah, but they probably do that intentionally because they know that there's stuff, probably, the moment they put that mod out there, they know people are gonna either come back into the game or you know like they know how to play with with all that you know they know they know what to release and what to release it after how long like the moment prime continuity really comes come back out comes back out when the battle tier arrives like, I feel like that day it's gonna be massive like everybody's gonna want to dig into that one month. And I'm pretty sure anybody who has like millions and millions of credits is gonna just purchase like probably 50 of those and try to sell them. <laughs> it's not just the credits you need, you need a whole bunch of them uh, other things. Ah. Yeah, I'm pretty sure like, you know, there's people that probably grind this game so much that, <clears throat> you know. I've got several million credits, but uh... Like, I have such a hard time selling my Prime parts, even ones I don't want, that I don't intend on using. It's, uh, I'm, yeah. I'm a little bit of a hoarder with Prime parts. It's like, but but they're mine. <laughs> but hear me out, right? <clears throat> Let's say you're somebody who has that much. You've probably been grinding the game. They've probably been grinding the game way longer than us, right? So they probably have a crazy amount of sets, but then Prime Continuity comes out. What are you gonna do? They're gonna sell everything for ducats because those prime mods are gonna be worth more <coughs> than anything <laughs> in the game. It's be mad yeah, I, just, like that. I don't feel that the ducats that you get are worth the amount of effort it takes to do the unlocks for the uh, the relics. It's oh, like for some not. of them it is, but for a lot of them it, it's it's really it's not. Like it's like it took me thirty <laughs> minutes to get that, and you want to give me twelve ducats? <laughs> Fuck you. I still have ducats left over from the last visit. I had like 2,000 ducats sitting around. I didn't. I only bought one thing because I didn't jump on. But I wanted to get my hands on the mods. Right. I was short on the credits. Infected palpatars. What is that for? I forgot. I only got one. Yeah, uh, the Juggernaut drops those, and it allows you to be able to build uh, certain things. Uh, I wonder if they're going to use those rare stuff from Juggernauts and stuff like that that we can use for future builds, like better weapons. Yeah. Super Ultra Rare. <clears throat> Super Ultra Mega Rares. <laughs> Dude, I might have to get off though. I gotta tend to my daughter, but probably yeah. Out later. Uh, we've been we've been streaming for a while. I was actually about to end my uh, stream. I'm just typing something here into chat first. Is it Guap Nation? <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's not Guap Nation this time, <laughs> sir. Oh. All right, guys. So we're going Go. to uh, raid another streamer that uh, that uh, I've watched a couple times. He's a pretty cool guy. Uh, his name is Cordy Pimp Juice. He's playing Overwatch right now. So uh, thank you guys so much for hanging out with me. We're going to go ahead and end my stream here, and then we'll uh, go on over there and uh, pay him some respects for a couple minutes. Thank you guys so much for hanging out, and we'll catch you next time. Bye.